You have created several parameterized components in this course. Let's create a library to facilitate our access to these components. You will learn how to create this library in this practical example. First, let's access the tool palettes. Right-click one of the tabs on the open palette and select the new palette option on the open menu. Name the new palette and press Enter to confirm it. The palette is now created, but it is still empty. You need to open the Design Center to insert new elements on this palette. Let's search in the folders where the available files are and drag these files into the new created palette. This way, you can easily create palettes which contain parameterized components used for a great number of layouts. It is so simple to insert these elements on palettes. Just select the element you wish to use and drag it into your drawing. This is how an inserted element becomes a block. Double-click the name of the element to open it in the dialog box, display it on the list and confirm the action. The block editor interface is open, so you can perform the desired changes. After all changes are finished, click Save Block and then Close Block Editor in order to return to the drawing. So, you have learned how to create a library with parameterized drawings, insert these elements into drawings and then edit them in this practical example.